yay. Oh my god, how long has that been muted? Oh god, crap, brick, no. I really hope that didn't get muted throughout the entire rehearsal link. It, no, it didn't. It didn't. It didn't. Ah, oh, I'm gonna freak myself. Oh, okay. I've been super stressed today. I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna fucking lie. I'm stressed as all hell today. Oh, but we're here, and we are gonna hang out. We're gonna have fun. We're gonna kill it. We're gonna freaking do it. Okay. Like I don't care. I love the series, and I'm super excited to be continuing it with you today. Um, so yeah, are we gonna kill it? Yes, we are. It's like there's no way we're not gonna kill it today. Let's go ahead and give you a little quick rundown of the team. You guys got to see while I was grinding that we had fun with our little Trojan. Um, our Butterfree now. we I did evolve it. I wanted to keep it a Metapod just because it was like, it had pressure, lonely nature, having pressure with hard, or with a uh, block. It doesn't have block anymore. Um, <laughs> caught in the dream yard. Like it was all like, it was all perfect. But like, I couldn't do it. I, I needed a flying month. Slash a mon that has electric coverage. And Trojan does have that. So I am very glad. I'm very happy. We got Tail Glow, Gust, Shock Wave, and Thunder Wave. Um, we also know that Shock doesn't miss. It's the electric type Swift. So it was kind of something we needed. Very happy we have it. Um, and you need to have it too. Looking at all you 16 to 18 year olds. I mean, anybody who needs it. But like, specifically that age group. Um, that was weird. Okay, so Rhonda, we have, who I still need to change the female, but I named it Rhonda, so at least we got that figured out. You know, we can't figure out Rhonda's gender, but, you know, we can figure out that we can name it Rhonda, so that's good. Uh, met at level zero, by the way, totally. Um, with a hasty nature, superpower circle throw, detect, and sword stance, Naomi, fairy cutter, make a, make a horn, tail glow, natural gift, and Jonas with stall, barrel ball cut. Inferno and Psychic. We are going to put Jonas in the front of the party because we want Jonas to evolve. He's four levels away from that. I did look it up or I'm not like I just wanted to see. I was like, oh, is Jonas going to evolve soon? And then we figured out, yeah, Jonas is going to evolve soon. So that is a positive. Today we're going to hopefully encounters. Hopefully fill out the team, which means that yay, editing at midnight. Y'all, we love it. Um, sorry, I'm going to take off the... I have my camera up here where I can see myself and it's just... It's being a distractor. Anyways, so today, we have an interesting topic. So, I actually have a topic for today's video. Oh my god, it's almost like I just got home from work. Um, just showered up, got in my blue Friday apparel, because blue Friday, you know, we're out here hanging out. It's technically Thursday when I'm recording, but uh, today was a day. Um, I... Yeah. I'm trying to like, think of the best way to describe today without biatching about today. Because, oh my god. So, basically, I got moved around everything. I had to be Superman today. And, you know, I get paid for that now, so it makes sense. It's just, it's not something that I'm accustomed to, I guess, is the best way to explain it. Like, you're not, you're accustomed to, like, you know, just choosing to be Superman. <laughs> and, like, choosing to be Superman is different than having to be Superman. And because of that... Oh, wait. So because of choosing to be Superman, it's like your brain's okay with it. But then when you have to be... There's the full heel, dude. He, t he makes you do a quiz. Um, so because I have to be Superman... It's like having and wanting two different things. Um, did we talk to Fennel? It does not look like we talked to Fennel. Either that or I didn't activate it. No. Um, I didn't activate it. Okay. We have to go talk to Fennel. So, yeah. Having to be Superman is a different story than wanting to be Superman. Uh, and it's definitely a hardship when it comes to like working and all that stuff but speaking of working our main boy was there today oh my god like i'm gonna like and so i forget how awkward i am and 
everyone's gonna be like, oh no. I'm sorry, you're dealing with first week of the month, John. It's fine, we're gonna freaking do it. Sorry you have to deal with first week of the month, John. But there's nothing I can do about it. It's just, the timing was great. Um, and so I had multiple gosh dang opportunities. Multiple, <laughs> not just one. I was ranting about it in my Discord, which nobody even like mentioned or talked about because it was just like, oh, just obligatory John ranting about something stupid. And then they just turn in their chair and forget that it's a thing. Um, and just pretend it never happened. <laughs> which, to be fair, it's probably a good idea. And I totally respect that because, oh my god, it would have been a train wreck. If you, any of you guys wanted, like, if you wanted to join the conversation, I can tell you it would have been a train wreck. Um, oh, I can, I can change it. What? I didn't know you could change it. Okay. I, where, how do I get the hidden items, though? Isn't it the, there's a button that allows you to see hidden items, right? Or do you get an upgrade to your X-Transceiver, and then you're able to see items again? I don't remember. It's triggering. Pal pad? No. No, it's not that. That has got to be an upgrade to your X transceiver. I thought that you actually just got it, but there's not. Okay, but yeah. So I was triggered today because my social awkwardness when I'm enthralled with somebody is through the gosh diggity darn roof, and I hate it. Okay, like I get triggered because I am wanting to sit here and like jump on somebody and, <laughs> and like I can't because one work even though I had an opportunity in the soccer and I'm making myself upset about it and so <laughs> again I hate when I just can't seem to bring myself to actually you know think you know oh my god it's like yeah Ugh! sorry I'm like I'm like being quiet, but not quiet. And it's because I'm at the house, right? And like in my brain or in my head, I'm like, I want to just blah and like word vomit. It's, it's like 1030 and word John, first week of the month, word vomiting John, not a good idea. We don't need it, but I'm recording anyway because it, this video is supposed to go out literally tomorrow and I got to edit it tonight. And so, and then, you know, after the work today, today, I was just like, ah, so. Carrying on, I then we were closing, and I got moved up to customer service today, which is like score because I like customer service. It's like it. Farfetch has arena trap. Farfetch has arena trap. Yes, so lovely. Okay, so so anyway, carrying forth. Yeah, it was great because like I had a second opportunity. Where, where I, my apathetic ass is over here like, yeah, I can see that being an issue and like all this stuff and like, let me comfort you and be there for you and like show you that I care by like empathetically agreeing with you and like, oh my gosh, like I, I understand. I feel that that's like, like totally something that would frustrate me and all this stuff because I mean, it's not that it's not true because it totally is. Like, what, what was being talked about was totally true. And it don't crap out of me when people do that. But I'm over here like, ah! like, I know, I get that. You're showing your similarities. And like, it's fine. But like, say something of meaning. And it's just like, I can't drag a simple word of meaning freaking out of my... It's like, that's, I think that's what I'm most triggered about. Not even gonna lie. I honestly, I think that right there is what I'm more triggered about. It's the fact that <coughs> I couldn't, I literally could have said something of meaning at any point, at any freaking point, I could have said something of meaning. And what's your hobbies? What do you like to do outside of work? How is this? What is that? Maybe we should hang out sometime after work. Blah, 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 blah. And I can continue down this dang cycle. And yet I'm here like, Oh, I understand your feelings in this work context scenario. 
And then uh, I had a third opportunity. And I'm still triggered because I'm sitting here being like talking about it because I can't do anything about it. But, and you know, some people will be like, why are you triggered about something that you can't even control in the first place? It's like, but no, it's not that I'm triggered that I can't control it now. That's what I'm triggered about. I'm triggered about the hindsight of I 100% could have actually done something and I didn't. <laughs> That's the trigger, not the other thing. And so I have a third opportunity, right? Leaving out the door, we're out, we're talking, and a vacation gets mentioned. And it's, and my, I was like, I, I, the words are fumbling in my mouth like oh where are you going what's go what are you gonna do what's this that the other let me learn about you and instead my brain says well have a good vacation you better tell me about it later <sighs> like bruh that was literally a segue to talk more but no no. My brain says, have fun. Let Tell me about it later when you're freaking off your vacation. Opportunity to learn about you more? Brain, have a great time. Be empathetic and sympathetic with the person. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Today's video. <laughs> I can't wait for the comments today. <laughs> um, the, the comments today are gonna be great. They really are. And I didn't even turn on my freaking light because I'm a dumb. Hi, light. How are you? It's almost like I should have turned you on in the first place. So, we're making it nowhere in today's video. You know, and we're I'm, I'm down with this. You know, we're making it nowhere. And... It is what it is. Hit it. Like, I, it just, it's just what it's going to be. Did the Bengals win today? You know, I could look it up on my phone, but, you know, we're leveling up. It doesn't matter. Bengals. Bengals did win. Yeah, yay. We're 1-0 um, in predictions this week so far. Good, good, good. Wow, Jacksonville was up 14 to nothing and then just got smoked. Good job, Jacksonville. You flubbed it up. <sighs> Anyways, carrying on with my freaking trigger. Um, no, I don't actually don't need to carry on my freaking trigger because like uh, Like I said, I'm more mad That I had opportunities and my brain's like Empathetic 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 you can do it blah, 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 and it's like brain just for once make a move Do something other than dumbly standing there like, oh my god, like, like, I want to jump on you. No, uh, brain, stop. Like, I get that you want meaningful conversation, brain. I get, and that I'm not even going to complain about, because meaningful conversation is great. But to have meaningful conversation, your conversation has to be both ways. And, and that's where the trigger lies, right? Because I will sit and listen to you all day, all day long. I don't say a word. I really don't. I can sit and listen. But when it comes to talking and saying words and implying... When I'm not doing, like, I'm, this is comfortable for me. Like, blowing in front of the camera, talking to you guys, even though I'm not getting any reciprocation back, it's weird, because that's fine, and my brain's okay with it, and it doesn't change anything. Once you get a person in front of my face, it's like, all sense of social interaction and social construct goes. It just zooms out of my brain. Like, I've been doing YouTube for almost nine years. Which, what is your, what do you do in YouTube? You talk to people, you meet people, you entertain people. 
And then when I'm out in the actual world, I'm just not. <laughs> and it's triggered. <laughs> because it's like, it's not that different. If you look at it in a, like, X, Y, Z situation, it ain't that different. Like, I am choosing to talk to people during my free time. But I can't do it not during my free... It's like, it's like brain. Like, okay. Does anybody else go through this struggle? Like, okay. I say this, like... I say this obligatory question. Only because I know the answers. Of course people go through the same struggle. But... I don't get it. Because in high school... Like, in high school, I was very, very social. And, like, yes, I didn't fit into any social norms or social molds. I was still out there and social with people. So, like, I could still have a genuine conversation, chat it up, and have a good time with somebody. Now, it's like, my again, my brain freezes. And just is like, mm-hmm, yeah, blah, yeah, blah, yeah, little blah here. Like, why? Like, what changed in those, in that matter of time that would make it so that I'm not like that? And, like, and it's not that I'm mad that I'm not like that, because that's not the case at all. Like, I don't, I guess, it's not that I'm mad about it. But I'm not happy about it either. Because I feel like... I don't know what would have, I guess, brought that change. Other than not being able to, like, talk to people in person. And be with people in person enough. But, like, I work in retail. So that's, like, almost a false excuse. Because it's not that I don't have the opportunity to talk to people. Because I do have the opportunity to talk to people at work. But, like, I guess doing at work things and being at work is different because you want to talk about the at work side of things. Also, I just circle through like dumb. Um, and it does. It makes a difference because you're not talking about your interests, what you like, how you feel. Because at work, I'm, I've am i never been the whole um, I've never been a like Social, have to follow the trends and be part of the trends kind of person. I've always been those the people that just sit on the sidelines. And I guess that's, I guess that's a difference, I guess, that hasn't changed. Is I like being able to sit on the sidelines. And, like, be a part of a team and be a part of something amazing. But I don't like asserting myself into situations. And I guess that's a big, big key. I guess something you can key in on. It's like... I, even when I'm not, oh, hi, I'm battling Tehran again. Great. Love it. Um, I guess that's a good, good key. A good key to think about is I don't like asserting myself in social situations just as much as I don't like asserting myself in, like, physical situations either. Um, I'm not an assertive person. I've, I've always been a turbulent person who will just chill and have a great time with you and doesn't need to be a part of everything. I can just be big chillin', <laughs> I guess. Um, so I guess I can see that being what it is, and that part of it is that I want to sit and have a good time with somebody. Oh, that's a citrus berry, right? Okay, good. Or an orange berry. Okay. But, again, I just... I never uh, quite understood why I've been unable to do that. Or why I've been unable to show myself except for in YouTube. I I guess like, and like not knowing why or the, the ins and outs and like I want to get better but I don't let myself because I, I is it like and you think you think about it and it's like well is it fear of embarrassment? No. Because pff, I embarrass myself all the time on YouTube. Um and do I care? No. But. Bruh. Tarot. Stop. Freaking Kyogre now? <laughs> um. And it's like. Again. Not. I guess it's the not knowing. 
of why is a big deal because you want to know why and you want to get better and you always want to succeed but ow dude dude Tarot Tarot needs to chill okay um Dude, Toronto was even slower. Um, what do I do with the Kyogre? Dude, Toronto has had a Moltres that wrecks me, and now a Kyogre that just wrecks me. Keeping Jonas alive is imperative. And I need Naomi. Or I don't need Naomi. I need Trojan. But what I'm worried about is Naomi not being able to live. And then having to send out Rhonda at the same amount of HP anyways. So it's like, do I I I, I think I need Trojan too much though. I mean, we can check summaries. 26 versus 30? That's not that big of a difference, actually. Naomi should be able to live a hit. If it's a bubble with me again, Naomi should be able to live. Yeah, Naomi lived. Okay. But not for very long as Naomi's gonna die now. <laughs> because there's nothing Naomi can do to this thing. That it would be be much better to just use Rhonda. And unfortunately let Naomi go. So Bubble would be stronger than uh, Water Pledge right now. But well, it does get buffed in Gen 6 to 80. So, right now it's 50 base power, so we can take advantage of that. And I'm gonna super power. Uh, I'm gonna super power, because I don't. I still don't. Oh my. Why? Um, um, excuse me. Dude, uh, and I've got nothing I can do. I can stall a little bit. But not realistically. Okay, I gotta sack Jonas off. What do I do? This is a Wonder Guard Kyogre.
Like, Thunder Wave is the better play. But that does 30 points of damage. It's 30 to- the roll is 30 to 33. Oh, God. Okay, so we're, I know we're fine because Water Pledge is less. So the only thing it would hit me with very hard is Bubble Beam. 